Hello, everyone from Trustcom family. I'm saying hello to everyone here in Nigeria and in diaspora. A very beautiful and blessed day to all the great people of Trustcom. I must especially appreciate our great and very, very hardworking state coordinators, all our state coordinators, including the FCT all the cluster heads and also my special appreciation to our six uh, geopolitical zona leaders. I commend your hard work, our NGO cooperative societies, NGO owners. I commend all of you, it's not easy. It's not easy. But if you want your work to be easier, please engage women. Yes, so work with women and you will surely get a better result, I promise you. I also must commend our ABLE consultant, Madam Mary Alexandra, who is, um, as I'm told, is not feeling well. Hmm. May God restore your good health so you can come back and do your job. I'm doing part of your job anyway right now, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, my name still remains Binta. And uh, from the recent developments, I have come to realize that there has been no iota of sincerity in the ground community in the past. And that is why things are in shambles. Trustcom is a brand new deal with a highly reputable BOT members who have given me the chance to run things here. And engineer Moses Igoche is a man with a heart of gold as he is so interested in the progress and success of Trustcom. My good people, at this stage, eh, I know how much money is in millions that have gone into the strategic setup of Trustcom. And that is the reason why I keep emphasizing that nobody, and I mean nobody, should carry over any bruhaha or hulabalu from the grand community of the past into Trustcom. I have high regards and respect for all our team members, but I must tell you all that I will not hesitate to do the needful immediately I discover that anyone is trying to sabotage the image and reputation of Trustcom. Because right now I am disappointed in some of the VMs I'm hearing. We don't have any elders foreign in Trustcom, and to whom much is given, much is expected. And let me let you know that respect begets respect. What are we going to tell our foreign partners? The millions of monies that have gone into Trustcom cannot be jeopardized by anybody. We are shortlisting the name of youth that will be going for training. Some NGOs have submitted projects that are just lying there for the past four or five years. We are trying to collect this project now the project plans. No NGO has been able to access grants in the past. All they did was collect monies from people without any results. It's not done. It's not done. Please, if you have a project plan, kindly contact me for submission because I am collecting them myself. Please call me on 81 85 Six, eight. And when I say project plan, it should be very, very clear on area of intervention. And then the project goals and uh, the, you know, the project, uh, the goals and objectives should be smart. You must be smart in presenting your goals and objectives. And then your project activities must align with your project objectives. And then your monitoring and implement implementation framework must be logical and, you know, so on. They must be logical and so on and so forth. And make sure your documents are in order. So we don't need to waste much time for submission. But if we find that your documents are not complete, we can assist you in getting the necessary paperwork. So sorry for taking so much of your time today. 
I just had to see this one today to clear my mind a little bit and then you know but these things have to be done on time a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do thank you very much my name still remains Binta thank you very much take care